So I want to talk a little bit about multi-website. Multi-website is a very interesting com uh, concept that a lot of people don't really know really what that is. Um, so at a basic level, multi-website, I would describe it as the ability to control multiple websites within one uh, platform or e-commerce platform, um, or it could be a CMS for non-e-commerce websites. Um, and I think the most uh, easy example of that is Magento. They've been multi-website since they started the, the platform. They're kind of, I would say, one of the leaders in that uh, capability. Uh, and they have like a, a very sophisticated multi-website um, infrastructure. And why would you want multi-website versus just having a bunch of different websites? So for one, um, it's a lot easier to manage uh, multiple brands um, in one infrastructure. You might be sharing products across the different websites or sharing some data. Um, so I think you kind of get that consolidated value of having, uh, you know, everything in one place, even if you're managing a bunch of different brands. Uh, the other is international. Uh, a lot of people overlook internationalization. It's a lot harder than you think to sell in lots of different countries. Usually you have to have some certain different nuances around the e-commerce, even if the e-commerce websites are similar, they're usually not the same. And it's a lot easier to have, use multi-website to create those nuances for each country. Um, so then if you were going really big, let's get really big out there, like you might have multiple brands with multiple different nuanced countries from a multi-websites uh, standpoint, and then you can manage that with one infrastructure. Uh, and if you're trying to manage, if you're trying to do that without multi-website on lots of different websites, that can get kind of out of hand really quickly and it can be really difficult to post changes to all the websites. So one of the, the nice uh, advantages is, let's say you wanted to make a change to all of the different uh, websites, um, you know, the same change to all of them. It's a lot easier to do that with this multi-website infrastructure than it is to have, you know, let's say 20 different websites that are all separate because you'd have to make that change individually to all 20, whereas with multi-website, there's a lot of um, ways to do that more efficiently um, with uh, less work than actually going and trying to manage 20 different websites.